This is Dr. Heather Harrison. I'm a family physician at the Central Utah Clinic in Provo. Today we're talking about how to read your ultrasound. First of all, ultrasounds you have to be aware of. They're basically, you know, black, grays, and whites. They're shadows of the, of the object that you're looking at. I have patients all the time come in to me and say, they say I'm having a girl, they say I'm having a boy, but I have no idea what I'm looking at. The pictures are often difficult to discern, and they take, you know, a trained eye looking at them and, you know, reviewing what it is that you're actually looking at in order to adequately say what it is that you're looking at. So if you just handed somebody a blank picture and said, you know, what is this? I think most people, even sometimes as a physician myself, unless I knew what it was that I was looking at, I may not be able to tell you 100%, oh, this is a knee or something like that. But um, looking at multiple ultrasounds and through pregnancy, obviously you'll be looking at lots of ultrasound pictures. You'll start to see, oh, that's the face, that's the eyes, that's the nose, that's the lips, there's the heart because you can see it flickering, you can see the hands and the feet moving around, and then a lot of times you can see the gender parts as well. That's always what most, most parents want to know is if it's a boy or a girl. But in regards to, you know, actually as a lay person reading an ultrasound, I wouldn't expect any, I wouldn't expect you to have to do that. But at least being able to see the hands, the feet, the boy-girl parts, the facial features, ask whenever you're getting an ultrasound for them to explain to you what it is that they're looking at and what they're looking for. That will help you to be able to understand it and be able to go back and look at those pictures later and say, this is what we're looking at. This is the profile picture of my baby. This is my boy parts of my baby. But, um... They are difficult to discern, and you don't have to be able to say exactly what you're looking at. Ask the ultrasound technician to let you know what they're looking at.